Hello friends and welcome back to 60 Pass X. Just quickly, I wanted to say that I do apologize for not posting yesterday. Um, after I recorded Mobler, my chest was like, no, 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 <laughs> you're not working for no one and basically put me back to bed. So all of yesterday, I slept. I didn't go anywhere, I didn't see anyone, I slept. But now I feel a little bit better and I'm just hoping that after I've done this video, my chest ain't just going to go, no, 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 no. <laughs> Anyways, so back with 60 parsecs, I almost said something else. We've yet to do missions because I, I know full well that... I haven't done this based because achievements and statistics are disabled and whatever. So, ow. So, I just hit my hand on cough mixture. <laughs> I know nothing about the missions. I don't know what they're based on or anything like that. So, missions, space pursuits. The death bots are in pursuit. Unless April and Jell, and yeah, manages to sufficiently upgrade the shuttle in time, a tragic fate will befall a team of Atro citizens on board. Better get to work, April. The clock is ticking. So I need to fully upgrade the ship's engines, don't lose any crewmates, and finish the main objective in 20 days or left less. God, that's not pressurizing at all, is it? As I said, I've not done any of the missions. I know nothing about the missions because I know 60 seconds didn't have missions like that at all. Um, which actually, 60 seconds has a re-automized version and it was free to download. And so I downloaded that and I'll probably do a video on that sometime soon. Ow, just clicked my finger. So I've got to basically survive with these three what the hell is that noise okay captain angel the death bots are pursuing us the heartless machines will show no mercy however if you manage to fully upgrade the ship's engines you might actually outrun them and lose them for good it's a race against time you will need a lot of resources to upgrade the engine so it might be wise to find a planet to land on after all it would be difficult to gather the necessary ingredients in the dark void of space the crew is counting on you captain angel you're their only hope don't let them down no pressure oh rats you know the scratching sounds coming out the ventilation shafts late at night we have rodents captain they must have hitched a ride from earth if the infestation isn't handled the rats will eat your food supplies then probably you how will you deal with this problem i'm gonna slap them with some knowledge that's what i'm gonna do <laughs> i don't know i'm assuming that that's what the book is for just to slap them with some knowledge be like Learn to not pester us. About that rodent infestation yesterday, the results of your decision about how to handle it were unexpected. You researched how to des demo de blah 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 alien wildlife in the handbook and applied what you learned to the earth rats. Great news, Captain. It worked. They won't ravishly chew through your food supplies now, but you do have to love them. You were happy to resolve this conflict without bloodshed. Awesome. So I didn't slap them with knowledge, I slapped myself with knowledge. So do I have to worry about them eating and things like that? I'm assuming I would have to. There is nothing to report, Captain. I suggest you, Captain, would you mind covering your mouth when you yawn? I thought you got a good night's sleep. Wait, could this be boredom? Yes, I have heard that you humans need excitement in their lives to function properly. How curious. Captain, you're sitting in a state-of-the-art space shuttle. Drifting through the deep cosmos full of wonder and mystery. Can you at least pretend you're having a good time? Well, I'm going to slap myself with some more knowledge then. If that's what you really want me to do. Jesus. This book is getting more action than... Some. <laughs> I don't know what, but some. Browsing your Atrocision handbook on the to toil. I mean, in the airlock. You found... Oh, toil. Toilet. <laughs> you found a set of exercises and decided to try them out. You did jumping jacks all afternoon. How fun. But more importantly, it was healthy. You feel much better now. How would you know? You're a computer. Our solar shield is kaput. If the damage isn't repaired, you'll be cooked alive. We have spare panels, but they'll need to be installed outside the ship. How will you proceed? With strength, my darling. Strength. I didn't know I was supposed to repair and upgrade items like right away. Fully upgrade the ship's engines, do not lose any crewmates, finish the main objective in 20 days or less. What's the main objective? This? Oh my god, I'm already on day 7 though. It was a news article displayed from hundreds of years ago. It described a devastating war. And my cat is making noise. <laughs> but I got it, that's the thing. So, technically, sending him out might just help us. Although I can't guarantee that. <laughs> I'm on day 15. And I've got barely, I've got nothing done. 
I genuinely don't think I'm gonna win this. Oh my god, they actually ruined a lot of my stuff. Okay, basically what happened was a group of like aliens decided to come banging on my door with some clipboards and I don't have the weapon anymore because I gave it to that other dude. He's got it. So I couldn't do anything and now by the looks of it, they've broken a lot of our equipment. So that's very slightly annoying. Unfortunately it is empty, but for a syringe of sl oh yeah. Who should use the syringe? We'll give it to baby. Considering there was a fruit that baby had found and I decided to eat it and it was full of worms. She tried to spin it out, didn't work, and then she started doing handstands after passing out for like five minutes. So, that's a thing. Tom kicked the bucket. Bloody hell. <laughs> that's not what I wanted to know. What is up with you? You're bloody insane. Here, have that. Clearly you need it more than I do. The air filtration system got jolted around during the crash, and a crack may have opened. What will you seal it with the crack? I'll oh, seal it with a freaking cow. That's what I'm going to do. <laughs> I don't know how much longer this is going to go on for, considering I think now because I've passed the whole 20 days thing and don't lose any crewmates, I've lost that as well. Actually, I come to think of it now, I'm going to leave this episode here because now, now that I haven't actually really achieved what I was supposed to do, which is to do the whole thing in 20 days and to not lose any crew members... It kind of defeats the point of continuing on this mission, if that makes any sense. Plus, it will just continue into being a nat natural, into being a normal episode anyway. And I don't want 60 parsecs to go on for too long. The only reason I brought it up to five episodes is because I did five episodes on 60 seconds. So I thought it would be kind of fair. But with the 60 seconds reatomized, I will only do one episode on that because I'm just curious to know what it looks like. But uh, anyways, again, I just want to apologise for how late this video is going up. I had a lot of things to do today, um, considering in the house and things like that. So, just, yeah. <laughs> anyways, um, so if you did like this video, please click that like button down below. And while you're there, please click the subscribe button so you're told when my next video is uploaded. Bye.